next program is realize a two bit uh, comparator using very lock code so open the project so right click create new source very log module and two bit comparator so comparator add to project so it comparator it is actually uh, this is a comparator two bit comparator so a and b are the two inputs like this uh, a not a1 and b not b1 so 0 0 it is a two bit you can also compare four bit or eight bit words uh, also so it's a word a and word b both are actually two inputs so here for example you can see 0 0 is a two bit a zero uh, this b not and b1 is also zero so when you compare these two bits with these two bits uh, they both can be equal or it may be a greater than zero a greater than b or b greater than a so three outputs are a less than b a equal to b and a greater than b so it is a two bit comparator so three outputs and two inputs and uh, two inputs are of length uh, two bits so one down to zero okay a digital comparator is a combination circuit designed to compare two n bit binary words here n is actually two you can also do four bit comparison eight bit comparison like that okay so now uh, go to program so two inputs are there so i will write uh, a comma b as the inputs and it is not actually n bit is actually it is two bit so you should write bus and uh, one down to zero okay msb you give and lsb automatically stack as zero so a and b are actually bus here one down to zero that means two bits zero and one a not and a one b not and b one and the three outputs are there so let us call it as a less than uh, a uh, equal to b and a less than b like that a less than b a equal to b a greater than b okay what is the meaning of alg a less than b a equal to b a greater than b these are the three outputs and it is actually only one bit representation so don't write bus here click next a and b bus so because two bits uh, one down, bus of one down to zero and three outputs a less than a equal and a greater than b finish it so automatically this statement came now we have to write here program okay now you have to write a code always see uh, yeah, the keyword should come in blue color so you don't write always always at a comma b or if you are using small letter you can write always a comma b If you are using small letter, you can write small letter. If you are using capital, you have to write capital. Always at a comma b. Begin. Okay. Initially, we have to make uh, all the three variables as zero. A less than b is equal to zero. Then a equal to b is also zero and a greater than b also zero all the three variables are made zero next you have to compare if a greater than b then don't write uh, after if don't write semicolon if a is greater than if that condition is true then immediately you have to write a greater than b is equal to 
वन इनिशियली वट ए आल दि थ्री वेरियबल सर जीरो ए लेस दैन बी जीरो एक्वल टू बी जीरो ए ग्रेटर दैन बी जीरो इफ ए इज ग्रेटर दैन बी दैन ए जी बी इज चेंज इट फ्रम जीरो टू वन नाउ यू ट्रिप टू सेमी कॉल ऑन देर दट इज दोट ट्राई टू सेमी कॉल आफ्टर द एंड ऑफ ईच स्टेटमेंट सो इफ चेक द कंडीशन देन वाट यू टू डू हिर् देन ऑन दू टू सेमी कॉल Suppose that is false. A greater than B is false. Then you have to check else part. So else if A equal to B. So equal you have to write two times here. A equal to B. If you write only one time, it will not work. Again, don't put semicolon. If A is equal to B is true, then A equal to B is equal to one. So if these two conditions are fail, then definitely it should do should make uh, a less than b is equal to one, right? Initially, all the three are zero. If a is greater than b, then only you have to do this. Else, check one more condition that a is equal to b. Then a is equal to b is one. Else, a less than b is one. Now you have to write end. So always you have to make practice that right give tab like this. See module should end with end module. Begin should end with end. Else, else if else. Okay, so this is a program. Now I have to check syntax. So you have to save this. See some error is there. So you have to. Make uh, this is R E G. So to add one word R E G after declaring info output, you have to include R E G. Or you can write separate one more line. So I will write here R E G register. So it will show the error. See procedure as I meant to a non-register. So uh, since it is not. Uh, Uh, declared as a register, so that's why it's giving error. So once you put a register for all these three, this error will go. Now no error. So we have to check the simulation. My system, I think antivirus is actually stopping this. So two term, I have to click. So by default, it is showing all this. So right click here. First, I will give. We have to verify different combinations. So these are the different combinations. A not A one, B not B one, A less than B, A equal to A. See first, what is the output? This is zero 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 zero. Both are same. Zero zero. So this should be zero. This should be zero. Only A is equal to B should be one. Next, A is zero. Zero zero means zero. B is zero one. Zero one means one. Okay, zero is compared with uh, one, so it is a is less than b, so a is less than b. These two are zero. Next, a is zero, b is one zero. That means two. 
a is 0, b is 2, still a is less than b, a is 0, b is 3, so a is less than b, a is 1, b is 0, a is 1, b is 0, so a greater than b, 0, 1, 0, 1, a is 1, b is 1, so then a is equal to b, a is 1, b is 2, 0, 1 means 1, 1, 0 means 2, a is 1, b is 2, so here we should get a is less than b, then a is 1, b is 3, again also a is less than b, so a is 2, b is 0, so a greater than b, a is 1, a is 2, b is 1, a greater than b, a is 2, b is 2, so a equal to b, a is 2, b is 3, so a less than b, so like that last up to last you have to do, last one is a is 3, b is 3, a equal to b, so this is the expected output, so now here we have to give values, so force constant, I will give 0, 1. So, two values are there no ZZ. So, two values directly you can give. This you maintain for 100 nanosecond. Apply. Okay. Force constant. Uh, given 0, 1. So, here I will give 1, 1. A is a and B both are actually uh, bus 1 down to 0. So this is LS which is uh, MSB 0 1. This is 1 1. So 1 is compared with 3. A is 1, B is 3. It is compared. So definitely here A value is 1, B value is 3. No, so A less than B is coming. 1 is coming. A less than B output. So 1 is coming for A less than B for all other 3. It is 0 a equal to b is 0, a greater than b is also 0, a less than b. So now I will give opposite, a is 3, b is 1, okay. Right click, force constant, now I will give here 1, 1. Apply. constraint now for this I will give 0 1 apply constant okay now run one more time once you run now you can see a is 3 1 1 b is 1 so now actually a greater than b is 1, a greater than b is 1, b is 2 are individual. So let us see with the last combination, both are 1, 1. Force constant, 1, 1. You can give any both equal values combination, either you can give 0, 0 for both, 1, 1 for both, 0, 1 for both. So now I am giving 1, 1 for both. Both the values are same. 3 is, com uh, is compared with 3. So now run this. See, the third combination, both are given as 1, 1, 1, 1. A less than B is 0. A greater than B is 0. Now A is equal to B is 1. So this is I did 3 times force constant. A value, B value. Last combination, I repeat both are equal to 1, 1, 1, 1. So in the second combination, I made A is equal to 1, 1, B is 0, 1. In the very first combination, I made a 1, 1, 0, 1. Uh, 0, 1, 1, 1. So all these three combinations are done. So this is three times we did for combination. You can also write force uh, test bench also for this.